As a Squarespace nerd, I'm always in the Squarespace Facebook communities. And I had this question twice in probably the space of like three days. And it was my header when it's like a central navigation stacks. So what that means is let's say you have four navigation items, home, about, services, contact. That may be okay. So you'll have your logo on the left, your navigation items in the middle, and then maybe a contact button or some the CTA button on the right. What people were finding and what people have been finding for years with Squarespace is that when you add too many items in, it will start to stack onto a second line. So like, let's say you add in a resources link and then another folder. And then, so you'll have your original four and then underneath it will have the next two. And this looks, as we all know, terrible. So what people were saying is, how do I increase the width that the navigation can go to stop this stacking? Should be super simple, obviously, but as we know, Squarespace sometimes doesn't like to play ball with things like that. So it takes a little bit of CSS. I was happy to oblige. And so I thought, well, if anyone else has this problem, I'll send them the link to this video. So I'll take you on over to the screen and show you exactly how to do it. Okay, so we're on the code examples website now. And first off, we need to actually go ahead and make this central navigation. So if we go into edit site header, what we wanna do is go to here, which is our desktop. Then we wanna to go to header layout. Then in the header layout, you can see we've got the central option here. So we give it the central option, go to exit, and then you can see our navigation items are in the center. What I'm gonna do then is just show you how it will look when, let's say I drag these out, and we have too many folder items or too many navigation items. So you can see here, we've got the stacked header that we don't want. So you can see this just looks, it looks terrible. So we go into custom CSS by going into design and then custom CSS. And then we wanna create a few new lines. Then we'll just call this something like make header larger. And then I'm gonna paste in the code like so. And then you can see immediately the header width is increased so i'm gonna open this up and you can see perfect just to quickly talk you through it we're targeting the header nav which if i go into the google chrome developer tools is this so this is the header nav here and i'm making that wider so we're making it a flex and then the width you can see we can set the width to whatever we want and then we give the header title nav wrapper the same treatment, but at 80%. I just found this was what worked for me. So if I match that at 90%, it wasn't central. So you can see like it's off to the right and we don't want that. So I had to play around with this code and then 80% seemed to work nicely for me. So that's what works for me. Hopefully it works for you. Let me know down below. And if you did find this useful, please make sure to leave a like, hit subscribe and check out all of the Squarespace resources in the description below.